Hello guys, how are you doing? So, welcome back to my reactions, and as you can see I'm going to watch episode 143 of One Piece today. So this last episode was really good, and we got to learn some really interesting things, and more specifically this one about the Sea Prism. So apparently there is this way of cancelling or disabling these Devil Fruit powers, so I'm expecting this to actually be relevant uh, in some future episodes. Uh, so yeah, it was really interesting to know this, and I don't know when uh, or if uh, someone is going to use uh, these sea prisms to uh, actually fight against someone with Devil Fruit powers, because that would be a really big counter. But yeah, we'll see what happens. Either way, it was just something that I... Like, it was a really useful information, and I believe that it was uh, actually canon, even though we are probably watching fillers. But yeah, either way, it was really nice to watch everything in this last episode. Uh, unfortunately, we still see this moment uh, with uh, the Watton Pirates making their move, and uh, they actually uh, were uh, constructing this uh, tower to have a way to go inside of the Rainbow Mist and retrieve all the treasure. So, it finally happened, and now they are going to... like all the people inside of this rainbow mist, they are going to have to deal with these uh, pirates uh, trying to get all the treasures. So we are probably going to see some fights. I'm almost sure that Luffy is going to enter this rainbow mist again to help them out. But yeah, we'll see what happens. Either way, I'm really interested about um, all of this uh, story, even though it's probably filler, but I re I'm really loving all of this story e uh, either way. So yeah, we'll see what happens, just really hope that they defeat these guys and that they finally solve things in this place. And also like uh, for these Watton pirates to be uh, like arrested or something, I'm not too sure. Uh, mostly because what they're doing in this island is not good. So it would be nice if th those guys stopped being here and those uh, citizens were free to do uh, like to do whatever they want, of course. I mean, there should be still like someone governing this place, but at least someone who's actually good, not just someone who's uh, exploiting them and stuff. Uh, so yeah, either way, we also got to see like the situation with um, that... Um, with Rapanui's father, and I'm not sure if he's alive or not. We saw that he had this vision when they were like in this different dimension, and I don't know if he's actually alive and if it's actually this guy that we keep seeing uh, helping uh, uh, like destroy ads pirates. But yeah, it's uh, going to be interesting to see uh, how exactly this uh, ends. But I'm expecting it to be over in uh, maybe a couple episodes. Uh, so yeah, either way, really can't wait to watch this next episode, so I hope you guys are ready, and let's start it. There we go. Taking everything. And there's a lot of things. I, I really wonder what's going to happen to these treasures. I hope these guys don't... Don't end up with it. I mean, I'm expecting them to be defeated. I wonder w what would happen to the treasure. That guy. <laughs> that must have hurt. Expecting the treasure to be... Kept in this, uh, inside of this rainbow mist. But we'll see. Damn. Yeah, that was really bad. It's not him. These guys. Oh. If he cuts those wires. <laughs> Cutting electricity. I mean, let's see. Um, and they got really badly injured. Yeah, the action went inside of that rainbow mist.
Hmm. They're going as well. At least now they have a way out. And in. <laughs> yeah, I was expecting Luffy to... He's always causing this. Situations. I just love how he's really random. Always having fun. Oh my god. Yep. Yeah, I really hope they show how exactly that happened. I mean, they were probably threatened. Oh. Oh, okay. I don't know if they're going to show it, but we'll see. Yeah, of course. And yeah, that's going to trigger Luffy. That's what happens. She got the wires. Or that. <laughs> and it's still going. You can't stop now. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that was... It is so mad. Coming king of pirates or... Finding the one piece. Probably being... Being recognized. Damn. Yeah, exactly. Damn, these guys... Well, so much for a way in. Or out. They destroyed that whole place. Who was able to run that fast? So now they're all, all trapped inside of this place. And there goes all the treasure as well. Ah, that was nice of him. Yeah, Luffy can swim, so... Did you see Robin's face? She was so happy to see him saved. 
Luffy is probably a really important person to Robin. Since that moment between them. Yeah, it's all gone. And the guy survived. They didn't run, it just... Sure. You keep believing that. And these guys... It really needs to be stopped. Most important thing is getting out of there, though. I really like Robin. She's growing a lot on me. Oh. Oh my god. I wonder who actually wrote this book, if it's someone relevant to this situation. I mean, whoever wrote it should be someone who already saw this rainbow mist. Okay. Oh my god. Nami being the captain. <laughs> just going in circles. <laughs> These guys. That was really funny. Yeah, that was not funny. That was really bad. Oh my god. I don't think that will work. Oh. Oh. It's going to blow that and use the energy. Like the impact to propel them. Yeah, he can sacrifice himself for this. And this guy. <laughs> oh my god, that was... <laughs> Just perfect. Yeah, you guys need to punish this guy. He shouldn't be that strong, I mean... All of these tricks, though, that was. <laughs> really need to get him. But this is more important right now. Oh, they're all going. I'm not leaving him behind. Is Enzo going to join them? There's no way Enzo is going to leave them, right? This is how it felt before. Damn, this is so similar to before when he saved them. Not like he said he was coming back as well. How about to become the citizen this time? To do something. Oh, 
Oh, it's there. Wait, what? Is that in the sky? Um. And there they go. Only the ship, though. It's just going to fly. And this ship already went through so much. Yeah. Straight at them. <laughs> I, I, I'm not even going to ask questions. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> this is like... <laughs> Yeah, that that ship is done. Holy, it's like sucking dimension. Oh damn, serves you right. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh, all the, all their money. Damn. That was a big coincidence, but that was nice. What about the others, though? Like Rapanui and the other friends. <laughs> the treasure. No treasure. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, and the other marines are here. The other guy was helping them, it's he... This one. It's Rapanui's father, right? Not sure if father... I want to believe it is. It would make sense, at least. I think. Of course. And this guy needs to be arrested. Oh. Yeah, sure. Nice. This! Yeah, this is exactly what I'm talking about. He used the coins, but he does his movement. It's his father, right? Yeah. Wait, it's all of them. Wait. Oh, yeah, she noticed something about that. So it's... Oh. So he didn't become a pirate, but... A navy guy. It's uh, a bit confusing, but I, but I understand it. All of these time... Things are really... Confusing sometimes, but... <laughs> oh There's no space for them That's nice of him
<laughs> That's so believable. Definitely not telling them to escape. <laughs> I like him. So it wasn't his father, but it was actually himself. That's really... That's quite the twist. I wonder what he's going to do. Oh, that's nice. They're recognizing him. I wonder who's going to be like the mayor and stuff. what happened they got saved they worked for the navy really nice for them to show this and he's actually the one who wrote the book is actually the author of it. I mean, it had to be someone who visited it already. That's really nice. Really? Is that the last volume? It's actually in the possession of Vivi and Igram. That's a really interesting way of doing things. Yeah, I don't think it rains rocks. A ship? Um... It's like a whole ship is falling on them. Um... I'm really confused right now. I wasn't expecting it to end like this, but... I really love what he did here. It was... I mean, it's like um, a bit confusing because of all of these uh, time-related things. But yeah, in the end it was pretty clear, like... Um, w what we saw inside of this Rainbow Mist uh, was, was basically happening. But the moment they caused this explosion, uh, they were actually sent to the time, like, um, like 50 years ago. So they never, uh, like... Um, it was like the time swapping things. It's it's so hard to explain. I mean, you guys probably understand me. This is really hard to to explain and to talk about. But I really understand that when this explosion happened, instead of like um like the fifty years didn't pass in the outside world. Instead, they just came out uh, right after they they entered almost. So yeah, it, the only time that counted for them was the time that they spent inside of this rainbow maze. So it was probably only a few days. And then they ended up in this island and they got saved by the Navy. And they ended up working for, for, uh, for the Navy and they uh, eventually uh, climbed like, and they became Navy officers maybe and, and things like that. And yeah, they basically kept living on just uh, at the same time as Enzo did. So Enzo was like trying to save them, but uh, I don't know. It's like, a, it's something that I'm actually wondering about now. Like imagine if... Uh, Enzo never, like, uh, went inside of this place. Like, we saw these pirates, uh, Rapa Nui and uh, his friends, in the other ships, uh, in the marine ships, when they were following uh, Luffy and the others. So, they were already outside, even before uh, Enzo and, uh, and Luffy and the others went inside to help them. So, it's a bit confusing, but uh, as Nico Robin said, it's, uh, it's like... Um, the the time axis or something like it's uh, it's messed up or something like that like it's it's hard to explain but it's something that is really confusing and I mean I'm I'm already used to some things in One Piece being like a bit weird and not really making too much sense 
but it was really interesting to see it happening like this. It's just like a, a something that really makes us wonder about because I mean it shouldn't uh, be possible because if uh, if they were already there, maybe it's because all of these events were already supposed to happen, like uh, Luffy and the others going to help them. Uh, it's something that was already like written, like it was going to happen, so that's why it's possible for um, for Rapanui and the others to be here even before they entered. Uh, so yeah, it's uh, quite an interesting way to do things, and I was honestly thinking that this guy who was throwing like the coins in a similar way that uh, Rapanui was doing his attacks, um, I was actually thinking that he might be, uh, or might have been his father, but apparently it's him, it's uh, Rapanui himself, so that was a really big twist, and it was nice to see that at least everyone is fine, and um, Enzo is going to be not together with them, because he's going to stay in this, uh, in this city, in, in Luluka, and he's going to be helping all of these citizens, so it, it was also really nice to see that the citizens are at least recognizing him and he's going to help them. I'm not too sure of uh, like who's going to become uh, the the mayor, like uh, they're probably going to make some elections, I'm not too sure. But yeah, it's um, something to wonder about, I'm not even sure if they're going to show it, probably this uh, wall arc is over and uh, Luffy and the others are already on their way to another place. And we saw at the end that um, this uh, ship just fell on them, so I don't know why that happened, don't know if it's still the Rainbow Mist uh, like uh, up to something, like m maybe a ship that came out of that uh, for some reason, but yeah, that whole moment with um, the Rainbow Mist disappearing and then appearing in the sky and then their ship uh, coming out by using the like the impact of that explosion, that was yeah one of the weirdest things I've seen in One Piece, that's for sure, like to see the the ship just going in circles in the air and then making a, a landing in the in the water and like being almost fine. I mean, it it, it was still there, so uh, it didn't get fully destroyed. It just had to to, to repair some of the parts. Uh, but yeah, that was a bit weird, but sure. And at the same time, it also sucked all of uh, uh, Watton's uh, mansion. So. The wall money would just spread uh, around the whole city, so the citizens got some ma uh, money back, I guess. So yeah, that was a really uh, interesting ending, and I, re I really enjoyed it, even though there's like um, these questions, like these uh, wall situations that makes us wonder about how is it possible. But yeah, really, really loved it. They did this in a, a really fun way, really enjoyed um, all of these uh, like things that they had to do, and these... Uh, like, even though it was a bit confusing because of these uh, time-related things, like, uh, being, like, um, time flowing differently uh, inside of this uh, Rainbow Mist, uh, it was still really interesting, and I was not expecting this kind of twist at the end. Uh, was, uh, like, expecting... Uh, uh, not really expecting, because we saw at the end that uh, they almost sacrificed uh, themselves in order to explode this ship inside of the Rainbow Mist, in order to uh, make the impact... Uh, uh, make uh, the um, the Go Mary like uh, propel itself to like outside of this uh, rainbow mist. But uh, I was thinking about uh, like what about Rapanui and the others? Like they haven't come out, so I was a bit worried. And that's uh, when they basically explained that um, it was these uh, marine guys that were after Luffy and the others already. So yeah, that was uh, quite something. But yeah, really really enjoyed it either way. And I don't know if you guys have like some better explanations, like uh, I feel like this episode already explained uh, pretty much what was happening, uh, even though it's uh, confusing, it's still uh, like not that hard to understand, I guess, just hard to believe in. But yeah, either way, really hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode, and if you did, please like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, I'll see you all in the next one, so take care guys!